Hi guys, it's Shell Sunbury Housewives. Welcome back to another DIY. If you're new to our channel, thank you so much for stopping by. Hit the subscribe button if you want to see future DIYs. So today I am making a cute little apple using the Dollar Tree plastic globes that's just now came out for Christmas. Let's go ahead and get into the video. So the first thing I'm gonna do is take some of my Waverly chalk paint in crimson, and I'm gonna add a little tiny bit of the black. I am so sorry. The black to it and mix it, because I wanna darken it up a little bit. I don't want this bright red. So right now, Dollar Tree has these water globes out in their Christmas section. So I'm taking the sticker off and I'm going to paint the entire thing this red that I came up with. And this is why I record while he's sleeping. I took this little teeny tiny wooden piece and glued it to the bottom so that when it does sit up, it actually has something stable to sit on because the bottom is round and it will not sit up. And what you see at the top right here is actually gonna be the bottom. So I have this little tiny wooden piece that I got from uh, AliExpress and I take a little moss paint, mixed a tiny bit of black in it and just painted it up. Now I actually got this basket from Pat Catan's when it was going out of business and I'm just dry brushing some white on it and um, going all the way around the basket. I still want to be able to see some of the wood so I'm just, like I said, dry brushing. I also dry brush some mineral. And lastly, I dry brush some antique wax on it as well. Mm -hmm. 
For the stem of my apple, I just snapped off a piece of dowel and I'm just taking the antique wax and saturating it pretty much so that it gets nice and brown. I wanted to add a little more dimension to the apple, so I decided to make up a mix up a little more paint, add just a tiny more black into it. So I just added some streaks along the apple. And then I glue the stem. I already glued the stem on, but I glue the leaf onto the stem. And then I'm gonna go ahead and glue on some um, gingham ribbon around the um, lid of this jar. Well, apple, it's an apple now. And then right here, you can see the before and after. And here they are all done on my tear tray. I love how they turned out. I hope you did too. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you next time. Bye guys.